Hello everyone, Barberry back with Resident Evil 1. Now, the first episode of Chris, we pretty much ran out of handgun ammo, and unfortunately I'm having to use my precious shotgun shells. And there's some enemies coming up I can easily dispatch with the handgun. I really don't want to use my shotgun, but it's either that or take damage, and we need all the health items we can get. So, put that up. Oh yeah, that's right, I said I was going to go do that puzzle first. Silly me, that's why I don't have the fourth one. Oh man, it's been a minute since I played Resident Evil 1. I took a three or four day hiatus from recording. Let's hope it hasn't failed me too much. Oops, already going the wrong way. Okay, newborn baby. Yes. Infant. Yes. Lively boy. Yes. Picture of a young man. We're going to get the picture of a tired middle aged man. Now take a picture of a bold looking old man. Let's kill this bastard. There we go. And there's the fourth and final crest, and let's get the hell out of the mansion. forward to wasting my ammo. I wish there was a way to just put all four crests in at once. It would really be a time saver. Now, since Chris has such a shit inventory, I'm going to go ahead and I'm not even going to uh, grab some of these healing items. Just in case I have to use a couple healing items and I want some spare room to combine, I'm just going to deal with the dogs now. Make sure, yep, I'm fully reloaded. Okay, I can still see him. Nice. I just killed both of those at the same time. That's pretty cool. I didn't get hit once. I really thought that was going to end very badly. Come on. Yep. Yep, that's what you get. Now, I will go ahead and take the blue herbs. Seeing as you can get poisoned in these areas, I really don't want to get poisoned and then have to worry about taking damage. Okay. Actually, I could probably use a green herb right now. Since I'm in yellow health, I completely forgot all about that. Full health. Okay, there's green. There's red. Actually, I can probably pick up all the healing items right now. That makes a happy billy. Mm -hmm. Okay, now. 
Yep, I got enough room. About time we started stocking up on some healing items. Can we combine just for the sake of combining? Let's go back and get that crank. Alright, you gotta be shitting me. There's not enough room to push it from right here. Oh, well, that's annoying. Oh, come on. You gotta be shitting me. Well, this thing moved a little bit differently on Chris's campaign than Jill's. Go up the damn steps, Chris. Let's go get to that damn guardhouse. Crank. And go ahead and skip this cutscene because you guys seen it in Jill's. And I know it's kind of bright and it's kind of hard to read the words, but I'll read them. The water is running down the opposite side. Which is kind of funny. I even turned the brightness down a little bit on my camera. Maybe it's just the way the camera is seeing the TV. Watch out for the damn snakes. Ooh, shit. Damn, they're ready to get me, too. Now, let's hope the dogs don't spawn super close to me. Ooh, that's not bad. Come on. Come on. Yes, let me keep getting the double shot. There we go. Good, not a single hit taken. Oh, shit! I forgot about you. What? I just shot. You piece of shit. We're still in green health, though. I was sitting there and I was like, I could have swore there were three, but I didn't hear another dog over the damn waterfall, so I was like, okay, cool, there is no other one. Ooh, do I'm going to grab any of these herbs right now. Damn, four shotgun shells? I'm probably going to run out of fucking shotgun ammo on here for fuck's sake. No oh, shit, I'm almost out of ammo. There, you fucking happy you officially took all my shotgun ammo, you bastards. Okay, I will save one of these green herbs for my return back. Okay, there's that. Mm -hmm. Grab another blue herb. 
And uh, we're going to save that green herb for whenever I'm returning back to the mansion later. Good old guardhouse. Good, and I'll start putting some of this shit up. Um, crank can obviously go up by uh, trying to put key items down here. Uh, green, red, and blue mixture can. There, green, red, blue mixture go there. Um, actually, let's go ahead and combine these. There we go, we got another green, red, blue. Green, red, blue, so those that's a triple green. Okay, actually I need to there we go. Um uh, yes, a handgun clip, because there's actually some zombies here. And I really don't want to waste my damn shotgun on them. It's just ridiculous. Okay. Put the F8 up. Those are special. Uh, where's my Beretta? There we go. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and put my green and blue herb up because I believe there's some blue herbs out in the hall. really doubt I'm gonna need all three of these but again better safe than sorry I'm trying to do a no death run I mean if I die I can just obviously restart but for YouTube purposes you can already see there's a couple of things that have caught me off guard even though I thought I knew these games like the back of my hand and I want to keep that shit genuine for YouTube I want people to get a little bit of a laugh because of if there's something I forget and it gets me in the ass, I really want to make sure that people are able to capture that moment. Actually, I'll put the blue herbs down here. Where's my green blue herb? Give that shit back. Come on, you bastards. Start limping. Give me a headshot, please. <laughs> oh my god. Ask and ye shall receive. You ain't dead. Now you're dead. Awesome. Oh yeah, that's right, Chris. Don't get the lockpick. Yeah, I thought there was something over here for Chris. Whoa. Should be some shotgun shells if I'm not mistaken. I think they're... That's what you get in all the little shelves. That is very well needed. Shotgun's really the only thing I'm going to have against the Hunters, aside from uh, my Magnum, but we want to save that for the Tyrant. Okay. 
Yeah, unplug that shit. I believe for Chris there should be a small key in here. What? Maybe it's another bathroom or something. Okay. Uh, check inventory. Okay, I still got two spaces. Okay, I believe the minute I go to move this thing, the tentacle's going to grab me anyway, so... Oh, nope, it didn't. Now, I'm only going in that room once, so I really want this to cover this hole down here because I don't need Plant 42 fucking my health up more than it already can be. Okay, good. Oh, shit. Okay. I was like, oh, no, I got too close over it. Oh, fuck me. Where's the red book? Oh, shit. No, I don't want the ink ribbon. No. Where the fuck that even come from? Oh, shit. Fine. Fucking give it. Oh, fuck me. Why the fuck is there an ink ribbon there? Ah! Oh, shit. Sorry, headphone users. I didn't think the other spider would get over there that damn quick. Holy shit. Next thing I knew, that motherfucker's on top of me. I'm like, oh, fuck me. Okay, let's go ahead and combine these real quick, because I had to fucking grab it. Okay, I shouldn't be needing the shotgun. At least for a while. Or do I? Uh, actually, I'll keep the red book on me, because I do know I will be using it. Well, shit. Mm, fuck it. Let's go like this for now. Spiders gave me a fucking heart attack, man. Now, you will have to deal with this room in, uh, for Chris's campaign. Whether you have Rebecca do it or him. And the code should be 2 1 5. You want to get all those lit up red, and it will unlock the door for you. Oh, wait a minute. Did I wait too long? Come on, give me the fucking key. Hurry up. The bees are coming. Oh, shit. And it goes to the other room, don't it? Ah, fucking great. Oh, shit. Okay, get rid of that shit. Actually, yes, I do need to equip the shotgun because I believe the bathroom has two zombies in it. Okay. I thought you spawned closer to them than that. What the fuck? Game's just finding a way to waste my damn ammo. Hmm. 
You ain't dead. Yeah, there's that blood spot. Fuck you. Should be, yep, the other key. Okay, very nice. Wonder where that other small key is. Oh wait, I think I remember. God, it's been forever since I played this. Um, zombie in here? Nope. Okay, plant 42 report. I'm going to go ahead and get this done for Rebecca just to make it ten times quicker for me. Spend a little time now, save a little later. Got to do the same damn puzzle, though. Push all three crates into the fucking water here. I was sitting there for a while, and I was like, why don't they just swim across or hell just try and leap it but then again for all you you know that water could be infested with the t-virus well no because then how do you explain how do you explain them running around with the sharks in that one room I don't know game logic I guess the game just didn't have enough puzzles <sighs> Come on, Chris, push that shit. There. So now Rebecca can just run across. Okay. Go get rid of this key and then I need a prep. before the bees come out. I only got five handgun bullets. I'm just going to waste the shotgun blast right now because something tells me it's going to take more than five handgun bullets to kill the zombie and then I'm going to have to end up using a shotgun shell anyways. So might as well just waste the one shotgun shell. What do you know? A handgun clip. There we go. So, no matter what, I had to spend one shotgun shell, but it's fine. Okay, well, where the hell's the other key? Hmm. Rip, run in here. Come on. You ain't dead. Come on now. There you go. Now he's dead. Okay, give me the damn V Jolt report. V Jolt is what the researchers were going to make to kill Plant 42. But, as you can tell, they didn't get the chance. They died. Whoops. There we go. There's that. Um, yeah, where the fuck is that other key? Hmm... 
Well, I may end up missing a thing of shotgun shells, but I will. Not really much I can do about that. Now I'm going to run back, gear up, grab some healing items. I can't remember if you actually have to fight Plant 42 on Chris's campaign or if Rebecca takes care of it all, but again, better safe than sorry. Oh, what if that small key is in the damn spider room? Just got to thinking about that. Well, I may not. Yeah, I may not need it. Colt Python. Give me a triple green. And, uh. Yeah, give me another triple green. Why not? We're gonna make sure we don't die to this son of a bitch. And actually. Yeah, I'm gonna put the. I'm gonna need a free inventory space. I'm putting the damn handgun up. It's not gonna do me any good against him. Really don't want to do my fucking magnum, but again, better than dying. And I sure as hell ain't fighting that thing with the knife, even though I've seen it done. I did that for the Resident Evil 1 remake, and let me tell you, that was a bitch. And there's actually two ways to do this. You can go make V-Jolt yourself and take care of Plant 42. But doing it this way gives Rebecca a little bit more story. And she's a little bit more involved with Chris's campaign. Plant 42 didn't snatch her ass up, I'll never know. Okay, I already unlocked the door. Okay, let's see. Actually, I'll grab the ones over here so way I can't accidentally grab one I don't need. You should only need three of the four empty bottles. And then there is the formula to make V-Jolt. Well, not necessarily to make V-Jolt. It's in the file, but there is a formula on the wall that tells you what combinations of chemicals make what. And I'm just going to show you what to do instead of you know, telling you, oh, you got to add this to this and this. So just follow my steps and you'll get it. So now I put water in a bottle. And now I need UMB number two. No, I don't want number four. I'm trying to remember where all the little shit is. UMB number two. Yes. Now, I need to get UMB number four as well. So, actually, I should have went ahead and got that. Okay. Go ahead and combine all of those. 
And water counts as one. So. Huh? Oh, you gotta combine them in a specific order. Jesus. So, get the water back. And I got UMB2, so I gotta get UMB4 again. Okay. Now, what you wanna do is combine the water with the UMB number two, which will make the NPO three, or we'll just say three, combine that with number four to make UMB number seven. Now you need to get another UMB two and UMB four and combine those. There's UMB four. Oh yeah, that's right. It's this one. UMB2. Now combine the UMB2 and UMB4 to make yellow 6. Now combine the yellow 6 and the UMB number 7. Makes UMB number 13. I need to get water and UMB number 2. And combine those to make another NP003. Come on, damn it. Combine the UMB2 and water. Make the NP003. Combine NP003 with umbrella number 13 and bam, V Jolt. Now I can destroy that ivy monster, which is kind of funny. It's foreshadowing because there's a creature in Resident Evil 2 named Ivy. Now we got to go down there with the sharks. I already did the water puzzle for the box puzzle, so don't have to worry about that. Now, I can't remember if Rebecca can pick up healing items or not, but since we're on Vance, she doesn't have the F aid spray that she usually starts with. So we're just going to have to be careful and not get hit. Of course, I believe this is the last time you play as her in the campaign, but I don't think you gotta go, like, if you go a certain way, the sharks will come after you, but I believe when you're playing on Chris, they just come after Rebecca. They don't give a shit. Let's see if they pop up. I hear them moving. Oh, shit. Yeah, we're not going to mess with that. Okay. There's Plant 42's roots. Make that some bit shrivel up. And actually, there's an item back here. I think that's the small key. At least they don't make you go all the way back. Oh, that's badass. You don't even have to fight the creep. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Aw, oh, son of a bitch, you do. Ah. Um. Oh, he smacked the shit out of me. Let's 
six sh really used all my magnum shots, you piece of shit? Man, he's a lot tougher on Chris's campaign. Holy shit. Man, that sucks. All six magnum shots gone. Well, the good news is we only got whacked once, so... Go out here and greet Rebecca. Let her know she did a good job. Oh! I can't believe it! Are you okay? Yeah. So much for him. We got to the root of the problem. Saved again. I just... Really, thank you. You'd do the same for me, wouldn't you? I guarantee it. Well, Chris, this is Richard's radio. We received communication from Brad at the courtyard a little while ago, but he is still flying around in the sky. He obviously couldn't hear our voices. Maybe his radio is broken. I see. Understood. I'll keep it. We should somehow let Brad know we're here. Good old radio. At the pharmaceutical room I found a little while ago, I think I will be able to make something. Anyway, Chris, I'm glad you're safe. I like how they can have that whole ass dialogue, you know, where the bees normally start to come after you and seems like it doesn't want to bother them while they're just standing there having a conversation. This room is fully equipped with medical supplies. I can treat you, except for your major injury. Would you like me to? Go ahead and get that free healing. Yes, please do something for me. Temporarily. Most of these medicines are from Umbrella. What's Umbrella? Don't you know? It's a large-scale pharmaceutical company based in Raccoon City. Oh, I see. Just got to get a little bit more dialogue about Umbrella in there. Uh, let's go deposit some shit and go see the sharks. Man, I can't believe it took all my fucking magnum ammo. Uh, I just hope I'm ready for tiring at the end. Uh, shit. going to put all the healing items up. Put this up. Mm, yeah, I might as well keep the shells on me because I'm going to be picking up more. Turn the corner, you bastard. Damn camera angles. <sighs> Just learned to teleport already, Chris. Hell, Wesker did. Man, this music used to always creep me out as a kid. I don't want to 
pick up the healing items just yet. Well, two, three, eh, actually, screw it. I'll go ahead. Why not? Come on. Okay, let's combine these, get them the hell out of the way. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. They're already fucking out. Come on, get me in that door. Get me in the door. Woo. Motherfucker. Oh, come on, Chris. Pull that damn lever. Suffocate those bastards. Should be a key and I can't remember if there's handgun bullets, but I... Yep, there's handgun bullets. There's the shells. Which I'm desperately gonna need with those damn hunters. Uh-huh. But I've stockpiled on health items, so I should be pretty okay for now. If the underground gives me some zombies, the uh, handgun ammo will work wonders. If not, then I can save it for the very end at the lab. Plant 42's root. Yep, I was right. There's the small key. Yeesh. Just that much more shotgun ammo I can use. Ooh, if I had the extra ammo, I'd lay your ass out right now. Yeah, give me that damn shotgun shells. Hey, here we go. We're starting to add up a little bit. monster. I lost track of her while we were scouting around. I hope she's okay. I see. Well, it's not your fault. This place is crazy. If we stay here, all of us will end up dead. What should we do, Wesker? We have to complete this mission. Whether we escape or stay and look for Jill, we don't have many bullets left and we can't even protect ourselves. We are still in trouble. 
Chris, there are a lot of locked rooms in that house. Check them out one more time. There must be a place to hide safely. I'll look around the house a little more. Okay. Let's get going. And Wesker is right, we are running low on ammo. Okay, there's a green herb on the way back. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up that green herb. Um... I don't want to put up. Uh, isn't there uh, dogs that I got to fight on the way back? Uh, shit. Actually, that's what I can do. There's no way in fuck I should go through more than 13 ammo killing two dogs. There is in the game severely fucking hates me. Let's go get our asses back into that mansion. Listen to the radio. Becca already told you it didn't work, man. Way to go to trust her. Now seeing as I won't be coming back this way ever again, go ahead and take the green herb. Equip the handgun. Can't remember if they were right outside this gate or if they were, uh, up on top of the elevator. Yeah, they might be on the pathway across where I go back through the other gate. Run, Chris. Make a break for it. Shit, that one tried jumping at me. Come on. Where the fuck are they at? Oh. Oh, shit. I don't know how the fuck I got away with that. Fuck yeah. That was hella good. I'm proud of that. We still in this to win this. Oh, now we get to deal with the fucking hunters. And I guarantee you they are going to fuck me up. And what's even worse is I gotta try and avoid some of them. I really don't have the ammo. Nah, we're not going to watch that again. Uh, 
Ah! Don't run down the hall, you fucking idiot! Go! Woo, shit! You fucking dumbass. Okay, I'm still in green health. I'm not doing too bad. Okay. We'll flip on the light switch. There. Oh. Oh, I do want it, but I don't want to... Well... There's the ammo disc. We'll grab that first, and I'm gonna have to come back and grab that magnum ammo. Oh shit! Son of a bitch! Wait, what the fuck? How am I still in green health? The fuck? It's probably stupid, but I don't trust it. That has to be a game glitch. I got hit, what, like three or four fucking times? Unless Chris just has a really big health pool. But again, I'm not fucking risking it. I don't know. How the hell I could take that many hits and still be in green health, but we ain't risking that shit. Okay, so his ass is gone. Right on! I didn't get fucking hit! Woo! I'll put some bullets in the back room. Use them in case of trouble. Wesker. Probably the only time you'll ever see me thank Wesker in the games. That bastard. Okay. Go ahead, pick up the shells. Need to open this up. Um, put the ammo disc up for later. I need to grab the clip. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and reload my magnum right now. Just wait, that ammo's gone. Let's pick this up. Come on. There we go. Grab this uh, fade spray. Okay. Uh, let's put the handgun up and the clip up. Uh, what do I want to use? Put the blue herbs up. Take that. Uh, actually, no, trade that because I want two full triple greens on me. Now I want to keep the magnum. Actually, yes. Oh, wait, hold on, I forgot. This is where I save. There, so I got to pick that key back up. Right on. Well, one more part down, everybody. We only got two more parts to go, and then Chris will be done, and I may do a fifth episode for Chris, like the bonus stuff. I'm not quite sure, but thanks for tuning in, and I will see you in the next episode. Peace.